The world is mourning the loss of internationally acclaimed author Toni Morrison, who in 1993 became the first black woman to win a Nobel Prize in literature. She passed away on Monday night from complications of pneumonia. Toni dedicated her life and career to writing about and exploring the black American experience. She was the author of 11 novels, including Song of Solomon, which received the National Book Critics Circle Award in 1977, and Beloved, which won the Pulitzer Prize in 1988, and in 1998 was turned into a film starring Oprah Winfrey, Danny Glover, and Thandie Newton. Her work was so impactful that in 2012, she was even given the US's highest civilian honor, the Presidential Medal of Freedom. In the wake of the sad news, many artists and public figures are taking to social media to honor Tony, who is also a mother, grandmother, and aunt. On Twitter, former President Barack Obama wrote, Toni Morrison was a national treasure, as good a storyteller, as captivating in person as she was on the page. Her writing was a beautiful, meaningful challenge to our conscience and our moral imagination. What a gift to breathe the same air as her, if only for a while. Bette Midler tweeted, just when we most need to hear her voice, she is gone. Thank you for the insights, the stories, and the poetry of your thought that have enriched us all these many years. Lay your burden down. And Common shared a quote from Tony's Nobel Prize lecture, we die, that may be the meaning of life, but we do language, that may be the measure of our lives. Along with the message, I'm deeply saddened to share that one of our greatest writers and minds in American history, Toni Morrison, passed away at the age of 88. May God bless her soul. Rest in power to a true icon. To see how other celebs are honoring Toni and for more on this story, head to Billboard.com. For Billboard News, I'm Jordan Rowling.